This project is a splatter. Uh, it's like a splatter project. So I'm going to make my body totally look like I'm dissolving. And I'm going to make it look like I'm dissolving to the right. That's why I made this dramatic looking picture of uh, my face. And I'm looking over here. I'm going to be dissolving. So um, I made a background. Uh, if you don't remember how to make a background, let's say you're just starting with your regular image and you uh, already cut yourself out. All right, you all know how to cut yourselves out using the lasso tools. You can even use a masking tool to cut yourselves out. All right, I don't care if you use polygonal, magnetic, whatever, cut yourselves out. After you've done that, make another layer. Drag the layer to the bottom. With white showing, you are going to hit um, Alt Delete and it fills the layer with whatever color there is so that's that now that we have that done we are going to make th make a three copies of this well before we do that let's move the body because I want to be a little bit more this way I'll move myself I'll physically do it myself okay I'm gonna be about here right about there I want to be uh, yeah that's good now duplicate yourself and you can get any picture you want and make it look really cool. We'll do three duplications. This one I'm gonna name backup. This other one I'm gonna call fat. This one I'm gonna call dissolve. Alright, uh, right. Now first things first we are we already have everything set up the way that it needs to be we have three copies of it we made a separate one we have a white layer alright now we've duplicated our layer we're gonna hide these two bottom layer this bottom layer and the top layer all I want to see is this one the fat layer and I called it fat for a reason I'm gonna click on this layer and I'm gonna go to filter liquify What liquify is going to do, well, give it a sec. Filter, liquify. Okay, thank you. I don't know why it took so long to open. I don't know what's going on right now. I'm going to cancel this. I don't know how that happened. All right, click on the fat layer. Go to filter, liquify. There it is. Don't know how or why it just did what it did, but it was, uh, it was lagging out. All right from the liquify menu you're just going to select a brush you already have your brush selected and you're going to drag your body if you can't drag it you make the brush size bigger by clicking on this and you're just gonna drag yourself over alright give it a sec I'm sorry for the lag folks I'm gonna drag myself over looks kinda funny I know it's supposed to. That's why I called it the fat layer. Moving stuff over. Moving my hips over. They don't lie. All right. Shakira loves me. Moving over. God, I'm corny. Moving along. All right. Let's stretch out that little sleeve. Keep it going. All right. Now, let's just say this looked wonderful. Oh, man. Whew. Yeah, this is great. Hit OK. See how it looks. Just take a look first. All right bring back your other layer now I want more of a dramatic on this so I need to stretch him more so go to the fat layer go to filter liquify oh shoot uh, I made a mistake there filter liquify sorry about that and I'm getting cranky it's the end of the day dragging dragging I'll drag a little bit more and a bit more over here and we want to go up with this because I'm dragging stuff up and my arms gotta be wider I want more splatter of the color of the arm right there that looks like it's gonna work alright let's leave that let's hit OK and let's see how it looks over it now we're talking this is all gonna be splattered I don't want too much up here but I want a lot over here this is really good now we're gonna create a layer mask which is right here. Oh, sorry. This is your layer mask on the fat layer. It's a layer mask. You're going to click on the mask. You're going to hit Control I to invert it. Now it's a hidden mask. You're going to go to the dissolve layer. The reason I called it dissolve is because, well, you're going to make another mask, but on this layer, you're going to make sure that 
um, you always have black showing and what black is going to do is black is going to erase if you click a brush on here you're going to select a cool brush like number 59 I have really quickly and number 59 I'm going to make it bigger to like a 94 it needs to be even bigger than that like a 201 now you can slightly click on yourself and begin to erase edges do not do this that's not going to work control Z you're going to just kiss it just little kiss you could double click you could really get a good one in there you can click now you can also click on this thing uh, I forget what this is called uh, let me roll over this thing see if it gives me the name it's basically the brush preset box a toggle for the brush panel alright well this is good because you could change the directory trajectory and the size of the brush so it's never ever going to be like the same exact thing change the way the brush looks and the size coming over here now oh, change it again again just keep changing it up alright so it's always gonna have to right and you can even change the brush too to like a number 39 change your trajectory way bigger than that that's fine get rid of this I want to touch the edge of my arm okay slowly I'm dissolving right and change your trajectory let's go to a 59 again I'll do a 46 and make the brush bigger bigger than that bigger than that that's good okay so now I have started to disappear on that end now this is where it gets a little bit more difficult you're gonna click on this mask now and you're gonna flip this to white and you're gonna reveal the other area this is what gives it that look of dissolving uh, we'll do like a, yeah keep it at 59 I guess uh, you can even do this one 59 make it bigger change your trajectory bigger keep going with it bigger you gotta really toy with this and now I'm starting oops too much I'm starting to dissolve change the trajectory on a regular basis because by doing that it gives you a, a better feel try and change your trajectory on a regular basis um, this isn't looking it's not too bad but if you go into this this one here again and you go to filter liquify you could also the way you, when you change this it's also going to change what the mask reveals on your other side looks like I'm a dog over here alright now I'm a fish so I'm moving over here again uh, make my hips a little wider let's hit ok and see how that renders and change it and eh, change it just a little bit not too much alright if you don't like what you did you can flip it back and kind of paint back Okay. Let's go back into here and get some more of the white. And you're going to have to really, really play around with the, uh, I'm going to just finish this up strong. Oops.
touching the edge. Sorry, I got in a little bit of a zone there. And now I'm starting to disappear. I got it. it uh, it's on its way. Oops, too much, too much. Sorry about that. And we'll flip it back. Get a little bit more color into this. And less over here. Brush. Oops, the other way. And you might want to make this brush super duper big for one sec, just just like to get the outskirts better. And there. Now we have dissolved. Right about there. Get rid of this one. Too much. Too much. And there you have it. Now I'm slowly dissolving. All right. That's the way that you do the splatter project. Uh, it can be done a little bit more tastefully. You just got to take a little bit more time with it and play with your splatter, splatter brushes. And you definitely play with the trajectory of how your brush looks. And this is how you make the splatter project. All right. It's not very hard. And uh, it actually is fun. All right. So enjoy this. And go slow because this one can get a little annoying if you don't know how to change the black to the whites and you're not mindful of your masks and you should always play with this box the brush preset box to make this thing look a little bit more not cookie cut like different um, different shapes for different splatters alright and that's that have fun and again we started with this made some weird shapes here some filters added that and it all sprung from this. All right, so have some fun with that. Oh. All right. Thank you.